our glory to you. Heaven, we can come with the spirit of truth, heaven, we are present in doing all things. Treasure your blessings and give of life. Come and abide in us and cleanse us from every sin and save our souls of the Holy God, holy, mighty, holy, immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy, mighty, holy, immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy, mighty, holy, immortal, have mercy on us. Glory to the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, into the ages of ages. Amen. All Holy Trinity, have mercy on us. Lord, forgive our sins. Master, pardon our transgressions. Holy One, visit and heal our infirmities for your name's sake. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Glory to the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, into the ages of ages. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done. Our in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory, for the Father, and the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, now and forever, and in the ages of ages. Amen. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Kiri Leson, Kiri Leson, Kiri Leson, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Kiri Leson, Kiri Leson, Kiri Leson. Glory to the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. Come, let us worship and bow down before God, our King. Come, let us worship and bow down before Christ, God, our King. Come, let us worship and bow down before him, Christ, our King and God. You heard me when I called, O God, of my righteousness. You strengthened my heart when I was in distress. Have mercy on me and hear my prayer. How long, O you sons of men, will you be slow of heart? Why do you love vain things and seek after lies? Know that the Lord made his Holy One wondrous. The Lord will hear me when I cry to him. Be angry and do not sin. Have remorse upon your beds for what you say in your hearts. Offer the sacrifice of righteousness and hope in the Lord. There are many who say, who will show us good things? O Lord, the light of your face was stamped upon us. You put gladness in my heart. From their season of wheat, wine, and oil, they were multiplied. I will both sleep and rest in peace. For you alone, O Lord, cause me to dwell in hope. O Lord, do not reprove me in your anger, nor discipline me in your wrath. Have mercy on me, O Lord, for I am weak. Heal me, O Lord, my bones are troubled, and my soul is greatly troubled. But you, O Lord, how long? Return, O Lord, and deliver my soul. Save me because of your mercy, for there is no remembrance of you in death. And in Hades, who will give thanks to you? I am weary and with me in my groaning. Every single night I will dampen my bed. I will drench my couch with my tears. My eyes troubled by anger. I grow old among all my enemies. Depart from me, all you workers of lawlessness, for the Lord heard by the voice of my weeping. The Lord heard by supplication. The Lord received my prayer. Let all my enemies be ashamed and greatly troubled. Let them, be, let them turn back and be suddenly ashamed. How long, O Lord, will you forget me to the end? How long will you turn your face away from me? How long will I take counsel in my soul, having grief in my heart daily? How long will my enemy be exalted over me? Look upon me and hear me, O Lord my God. Enlighten my eyes, lest I sleep in death. Lest my enemies say I prevailed against him. Those who afflict me greatly rejoice, if I am taken. But I hope in your mercy. My heart shall greatly rejoice in your salvation. I will sing to the Lord who shows kindness to me. I will sing to the name of the Lord Most High. Glory to the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit, both now and ever into the ages of ages. Amen. Alleluia, 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 glory to you, O God. Alleluia, 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 glory to you, O God. Alleluia, 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 glory to you, O God. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Glory to the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Both now and ever into the ages of ages. Amen. To you, O Lord, I lift up my soul, O my God. I trust in you. Let me not be ashamed. Let not my enemies laugh at me. For all who wait upon you shall not be ashamed. Let those be ashamed who act lawlessly in vain. Make known your ways to me, O Lord, and teach me your paths. Lead me in your truth and teach me, for you are the God of my salvation, and on you I wait all the day. Remember your compassion, O Lord, and your mercy, for they are from of old. Do not remember the sins of my youth, nor of my ignorance, but remember me according to your mercy, because of your loving kindness, O Lord. Good and upright is the Lord, therefore he will instruct sinners in his way. He will guide the gentle in judgment, he will teach the gentle his ways. All the ways of the Lord are mercy and truth for those who seek his covenant and his testimonies. For your name's sake, O Lord, pardon my sin, for it is great. Who is the man who fears the Lord? He will instruct him in the way he chooses. 
His soul shall dwell among good things. His seed shall inherit the earth. The Lord is the strength of those who fear him, and to those who fear him his name is the Lord, and he will show them his covenant. My eyes are always toward the Lord, for he shall pluck my feet out of the trap. Look upon me and have mercy on me, for I am only begotten and poor. The afflictions of my heart have been widened. Bring me out of my distresses. Look on my humiliation and my pain and forgive all my sins. Look on my enemies because they multiply and they hate me with unjustified hatred. Keep my soul and deliver me. Let me not be ashamed because I hope in you. The innocent and the upright cleave to me because I wait upon you, O Lord. Redeem Israel, O God, out of all his afflictions. And you, O Lord, I hope, may not be ashamed forever. In righteousness, deliver me and rescue me. Incline your ear to me. Rescue me speedily. Be to me a God who protects me and a house of refuge to save me. You are my strength and my refuge. And for your name's sake, you will guide and sustain me. For you will bring me out of the snare they hid from me. For you are my protector. Into your hands I shall entrust my spirit. You redeem me, O Lord God of truth. You hate those who maintain their empty vanities, but I hope in the Lord. I will greatly rejoice and be glad because of your mercy, for you beheld my humiliation. You saved my soul from distress and did not shut me up to the hands of the enemy. You set my feet in a wide place. Have mercy on me, O Lord, for I am afflicted. My eye is troubled with anger, so are my soul and my stomach. For my life is wasted with grief and my years with sighing. My strength is weakened with poverty and my bones are troubled. I became a reproach to all my enemies, and especially to all my neighbors, and a fear to all my acquaintances. Those who saw me outside fled from me. I have forgotten like the one whose heart is lifeless. I was like made like a vessel that is utterly broken. For I heard the blame of many who dwell round about when they were gathered together against me, when they plotted to take my life. But as for me, I hope in you, O Lord. I said, you are my God. My times are in your hands. Deliver me from the hands of my enemies and from those who persecute me. Make your face shine upon your servant. Save me in your mercy. O Lord, do not let let me me be ashamed because I call upon you. Let the ungodly be ashamed and lead them down into the Hades. Let deceitful lips become speechless when they speak lawlessness against the righteous with arrogance and contempt. How great, O Lord, is the abundance of your goodness. You hide for those who fear you. But you will work for those who hope in the sight of the sons of men. You shall hide them in the secret of your presence from the disturbance of men. You will shelter them in your tabernacle from the contradiction of tongues. Blessed is the Lord, for he had magnified his mercy in a fortified city. But I said in my ecstasy, Indeed, I am cast away from the countenance of your eyes. Therefore you heard the voice of my supplication when I cried to you. Love the Lord, all you his saints, for the Lord seeks out truth. And repays those who act with great arrogance. Be courageous and let your hearts be strengthened, all who hope in the Lord. He who dwells in the help of the Most High shall lodge in the shelter of the God of heaven. He shall say to the Lord, You are my protector and my refuge, my God. I will hope in him, for he shall free me from the snare of the hunters and from every troubling word. He shall overshadow you with his shoulders, and under his wings you shall hope. His truth shall encircle you with a shield. You shall not be frightened by fear at night, nor from an arrow that flies by day, nor by a thing moving in darkness, nor by mishap in a demon of noonday. A thousand shall fall at your side and ten thousand at your right hand. Yet it shall not come near you, but you shall observe with your eyes, and you shall see the reward of sinners. For you, O Lord, are my hope. You made the Most High your refuge. Evils shall not come to you, and a scourge shall not draw near your dwelling. For he shall command his angels concerning you to keep you in all your ways. In their hands they shall bear you up, lest you strike your foot against a stone. You shall tread upon the asp and the basilisk, and you shall trample the lion and the dragon. For he hoped in me, and I will deliver him. I will shelter him, because he knew my name. He shall call upon me, and I will hear him. I am with him in affliction, and I will deliver and glorify him. With length of days I will satisfy him and show him my salvation. Glory to the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, into the ages of ages. Amen. Alleluia, 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 glory to you, O God. Alleluia, 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 glory to you, O God. Alleluia, 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 glory to you, O God. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord have mercy. Glory to the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, into the ages of ages. Amen. God is with us, no this and be defeated for God is with us. 
Give ear all you to the very ends of the earth, for God is with us. Be defeated, although you are strong, for God is with us. For even if you should be strong again, you will be defeated again, for God is with us. Then do whatever counsel you take, the Lord will scatter it abroad, for God is with us. And whatever word you shall speak, it will not continue among you, for God is with us. Do not be afraid of their terror, nor be troubled by it, for God is with us. Sanctify the Lord himself, and he shall be your fear, for God is with us. So if you trust in him, he shall be a sanctuary for you. I shall wait for God, and I will trust in him, for God is with us. Behold, I am the children God has given to me, for God is with us. A people who walk in darkness, behold a great light, for God is with us. And you who dwell in the country of the shadow of death, upon you a light will shine, for God is with us. For unto us a child is born, unto us a son is given, for God is with us. And the government will be upon his shoulder, for God is with us. And of his peace there is no end, for God is with us. His name will be called the Angel of Great Counsel, Wonderful Counselor, for God is with us. Mighty God, Master Prince of Peace, Father of the age to come, for God is with us. Glory to the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit, for God is with us. Both now and ever and to the ages of ages, amen, for God is with us. God is with us. Having passed the day, give thanks to you, Lord, and I ask you to grant me the evening and the night without sin, O my Savior, and save me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Now that the day has gone by, I glorify you, Master. I ask of you to grant me the evening and the night without sin, O my Savior, and save me. Both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages, amen. Having traversed the day, I sing hymns to you, O Holy One. I ask of you to grant me the evening and the night free of plots, O my Savior, and save me. And the six winged beings, the seraphim, also highly exalt you with endless voice. Sings its praises of you with Christ's holy hands. You, O Father, existing before all things, have your Son unoriginate with yourself. And the equally honored Spirit of life, thus you show that inseparable are the three. O all holy and virgin Mother of God, and you servants and witnesses of the word. And with the choirs of prophets and martyred saints, all of you who enjoy everlasting life. Intercede with great earnest on our behalf, and as much as we all are in dire straits. So that all of us, freed not from the deceit of the devil, may seek the angelic hymn. Holy, 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 thrice holy Lord, have mercy on us and save us. Amen. I believe in one God. Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and of all things visible and invisible, and in one Lord Jesus Christ, the only begotten Son of God, begotten the Father before all ages, light of light, true God of true God, begotten not created, of one essence with the Father, to whom all things were made, who for us men for our salvation came down from heaven, and was incarnate of the Holy Spirit and the Virgin Mary, and became man. 
He was crucified for us under Pontius Pilate, and suffered and was buried. And he rose on the third day according to the scriptures. He ascended to heaven and is seated at the right hand of the Father. And he will come again in glory to judge the living and the dead. His kingdom shall have no end. And the Holy Spirit, the Lord, the Creator of life, proceeds from the Father. And together with the Father and the Son is worshipped and glorified, who spoke to the prophets. In one holy Catholic and apostolic church, I confess one baptism for forgiveness of the sins. I look for the resurrection of the dead and the life of the age to come. Amen. O Holy Lady and Theotokos, intercede for us sinners. O Holy Lady and Theotokos, intercede for us sinners. All you heavenly hosts of angels and archangels, intercede for us sinners. All you heavenly hosts of holy angels and archangels, intercede for us sinners. Saint John the Baptist, prophet and forerunner of our Lord Jesus Christ, intercede for us sinners. Saint John the Baptist, prophet and forerunner of our Lord Jesus Christ, intercede for us sinners. Holy, glorious apostles, prophets, and martyrs, and all saints, intercede for us sinners. Holy, glorious apostles, prophets, and martyrs, and all saints, intercede for us sinners. Devout, God-bearing, fathers, shepherds, and teachers of the whole world, intercede for us sinners. Devout, God-bearing, fathers, shepherds, and teachers of the whole world, intercede for us sinners. Holy Father Andrew, first called of the apostles and patron saint of this chapel, intercede for us sinners. Holy Apostle Andrew, first called and patron of this chapel, intercede for us sinners. O oh, invincible and indestructible and divine power of the precious and life-giving cross, do not abandon us sinners. O oh, invincible and divine power of the precious and life-giving cross, do not abandon us sinners. God be gracious to us sinners. God be gracious to us sinners. God be gracious to us sinners and have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy, mighty, holy, immortal, have mercy on us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, <coughs> and unto the ages of ages. Amen. All Holy Trinity, have mercy on us. Lord, forgive our sins. Master, pardon our transgressions. Holy One, visit and heal our infirmities for your name's sake. What a mercy, what a mercy, what a mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Our Father, Father who art in, in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory of the Father, and the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, now and forever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. O Lord, you know the wakefulness of my enemies, and the weakness of my miserable flesh. For you made man. Therefore, into your hands I shall entrust my spirit. Cover me with the wings of your goodness, lest I sleep unto death. Illumine my inner eyes with the delight of your divine words, and awaken me at the right time, that I may sing your glory as the only good one and true friend of man. Look graciously upon me and have mercy on me, as you do for those who love your name. Oh, how awesome is your judgment, Lord, with the angels standing by, the humans being brought in, the books of life being opened, the works being uncovered, and the thoughts being searched. What judgment shall be on me who has been conceived in sin? Who shall extinguish the flames of my fire? Who shall illumine my darkness? Unless you, Lord, have mercy on me as a true friend of man. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Give me tears, Lord, as you did once, the sinful woman. Make me worthy to wet your feet, which freed me from the way of error, and to offer you as a fragrant ointment, a pure life built in me through repentance, so that I may also hear... Your cherished words. Your faith has saved you. Go in peace. Now and ever, and ages of ages. Amen. 
trusting in your unshameable hope, O Theotokos, I shall be saved, possessing your protection. Most pure one, I shall not be afraid. I shall pursue my enemies and drive them away, wearing only your refuge as a breastplate. And asking for your all-powerful help, I cry to you. O Lady, save me through your intercessions and raise me from this dark slumber through the power of the Son and God born from you, so that I may sing your glory. Lord have mercy, 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 Lord have mercy. Kitty Layson, 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 Kitty Layson. Water mercy, 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 water mercy. Kitty Layson, 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 Kitty Layson. Glory to the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. Greater in honor than the cherubim, and in glory greater beyond compare than the seraphim. You without corruption gave birth to God's word, and are truly Theotokos, you do in thine In the name of the Lord, Father, bless. Through the prayers of our Holy Fathers, O Lord Jesus Christ, our God, and in the name of God, Amen. Lord, Lord, who has delivered us from every peril that flies by day, Deliver us from anything that lurks about in darkness, except the lifting up of our hands as a means of sacrifice. Make us worthy to traverse the time of night blamelessly, untouched by evil, and redeem us from every disturbance and fear caused by the devil. Grant contrition to our souls and concern to our minds about the accounting of your awesome and just judgment. Nail down our bodies with your fear and dead from our earthly members, so that even in the quiet of our slumber, we may be enlightened by the contemplation of your ordinances. Keep away from us every indecent fantasy and harmful desire. Awake us in the time of prayer, rooted in the faith, thriving in your instructions, through the goodwill and the goodness of your only begotten Son, with whom you are blessed, together with your whole holy good and life creating spirit, now and forever and for the ages of ages. Amen. Come, let us worship and bow down before God our King. Come, let us worship and bow down before Christ God our King. Come, let us worship and bow down before him, Christ, our King and God. Have mercy on me, O God, according to your great mercy, and according to the abundance of your compassion, blot out my transgression. Wash me thoroughly from my lawlessness and cleanse me from my sin, for I know my lawlessness and my sin is always before me. Against you only have I sinned and done evil in your sight, that you may be justified in your words and overcome when you are judged. For behold, I was conceived in transgressions, and in sins my mother bore me. Behold, you love truth. You showed me the unknown and secret things of your wisdom. You shall sprinkle me with hyssop, and I will be cleansed. You shall wash me, and I will be made whiter than snow. You shall make me hear joy and gladness. My bones that were humbled shall greatly rejoice. Turn your face from my sins, and blot out all my transgressions. Create in me a clean heart, O God, and renew a right spirit within me. Do not cast me away from your presence, and do not take your Holy Spirit from me. Restore to me the joy of your salvation, and uphold me with your guiding spirit. I will teach transgressors your ways, and the ungodly shall turn back to you. Deliver me from blood guiltiness, O God, the God of my salvation, and my tongue shall greatly rejoice in your righteousness. O Lord, you shall open my lips, and my mouth will declare your praise. For if you desired sacrifice, I would give it. You will not be pleased with whole burnt offerings. A sacrifice to God is a broken spirit, a broken and humbled heart God will not despise. Do good, O Lord, in your good pleasure to Zion, and let the walls of Jerusalem be built. Then you will be pleased with a sacrifice of righteousness, with offerings and whole burnt offerings. Then shall they offer young bulls on your altar. Hear my prayer, O Lord, and let my cry come to you. Do not turn your face from me in the day when am I am afflicted. Incline your ear to me. In the day when I call upon you, hear me quickly. For my days vanished like smoke, and my bones burned up like firewood. I was cut down like grass, and my heart became withered, for I forgot to eat my bread. Because of the sound of my groaning, my bones cleaved to my flesh. I have become like a pelican in a desert. I have become like an owl in a ruined house. I kept watch, and I have become like a sparrow alone on a housetop. My enemies reproached me all day long. All those who praised me swore against me. For I ate ashes like bread, and mixed my drink with weeping, because of the wrath of your countenance and your anger. For you whipped me up and broke me down. My days were far spent like a shadow, and I am withered like grass. But you, O Lord, remain forever, and your remembrance is upon generation to generation. When you rise up, you shall have compassion on Zion, for it is the time to have compassion on her, because the time has come. 
For your servants took pleasure in her stones, and they shall have compassion on her for her dust. And the Gentiles shall fear the name of the Lord, and all the kings of the earth your glory. For the Lord shall build Zion, and he shall be seen in his glory. He regarded the prayer of the humble, and he will not despise their supplication. Let this be written from, for another generation, and the people who are created shall praise the Lord. For he looked down from the height of this holy place. The Lord looked upon the earth from heaven, to hear the groaning of those bound, to set free the sons of the slain, to declare the Lord's name in Zion, and his praise in Jerusalem, when the people and the kingdoms are gathered together to serve the Lord. He replied to him in the way of strength, Declare to me the fewness of my days. Take me not in the way in the midst of many, my days. Your years are throughout all generations. In the beginning, O Lord, you found the earth, and the heavens are the work of your hands. They shall perish, but you shall remain, and all things shall grow old like a garment, and like a cloak you shall change them, and they shall be changed. But you, but you are the same, and your years shall not fail. The children of your servants shall dwell there, and their, and their seed shall lead to prosperity forever. O Lord Almighty, the God of our fathers, of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, and of their righteous seed, who created the heaven and the earth with all their army, who bound the seed by the word of your command, who shut up the abyss and sealed it with your awesome and glorious name, whom all things dread, and before whose power they tremble, because the majesty of your glory is unbearable, and the threat of your anger against the sinners is unendurable. Yet the mercy of your promise is both immeasurable and unfathomable, for you are the Lord most high. Compassionate, long suffering, and all merciful, and relent on the wickedness of man. You, Lord, in the multitude of your goodness, promise repentance and forgiveness to those who have sinned against you, and in your infinite compassion, for your repentance for sinners, that they may be saved. Therefore, Lord, the God of the powers, you have not appointed repentance for the righteous Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, who have not sinned against you, but you have appointed repentance for me, the sinner, for I have committed more sins than the grains of the sands of the sea. My transgressions have multiplied, Lord. My transgressions have multiplied. And I am not worthy to look up and see the height of the sky from the multitude of my injuries, being weighted down by my many iron chains, so that I cannot raise my head. There is no respite left for me, because I provoked your anger and committed evil before you, not having done your will, and not having kept your commandments. And now I bend the knee of my heart, beseeching your goodness. I have sinned, Lord, I have sinned. I acknowledge my transgressions, but I beg and ask of you, forgive me, Lord, forgive me, and do not destroy me with my transgressions. Do not be angry with me forever, and keep my evils in me, and do not condemn me to the depths of the earth. For you are God, my God, of those who repent, and in you you shall look, show all your goodness. For even though I am unworthy, you shall save me according to the multitude of your mercy. And I shall praise you without ceasing all the days of my life. For in every heavenly power sings your praises, and yours is the glory unto the ages of the Amen. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Glory to the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. All Holy Trinity, have mercy on us. Lord, forgive our sins. Master, pardon our transgressions. Holy One, visit and heal our infirmities for your name's sake. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Glory to the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and the ages of ages. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not to temptation, but deliver us from evil. For that is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory of the Father, and the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. Have mercy on us, Lord, have mercy on us, for with nothing to say in our own defense, we sinners offer this supplication to you, our Master. Have mercy on us. Glory to the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Lord, have mercy on us, for in you we trust. Be not enraged with us greatly, nor remember our iniquities. But look upon us now, being compassionate, and deliver us from our enemies. For you are our God, and we your people. All of us the work of your hands, and now we have invoked your name. Both now and ever into the ages of ages, amen. Open the gate of compassion for us, O blessed Theodogos. For hoping in you, let us not fail in our aim. Through you may we be delivered from adversities, for you are the salvation of the Christian race. 
Lord of mercy, 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 Lord of mercy. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy. Glory to the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit, both now and ever and to the ages of ages. Amen. Greater in honor than the cherubim and in greater beyond compare than the seraphim. You without corruption gave birth to God the Word and are truly Theotokos. You do we magnify. In the name of the Lord, Father, bless. Through the prayers of our Holy Fathers, O Lord Jesus Christ, our God, have mercy on us and save us. Amen. O Master God, Father Almighty, only begotten Son, Lord Jesus Christ, and Holy Spirit, one God and one power, have mercy on me, a sinner. And in your own way, save me, your unworthy servant. For you are blessed in the ages of ages. Amen. Come as worship and bow down before God our King. Come, let us worship and bow down before Christ, God, our King. Come, let us worship and bow down before him, Christ, our King and God. O God, give heed to help me. O Lord, make haste to help me. May those who seek my soul be dishonored and shamed. May those who plot evils against me be turned back in disgrace. May those be turned back immediately who shame me, saying, well done, well done. May all who seek you rejoice greatly and be glad in you. Let those who love your salvation always say, let God be magnified. But I am poor and needy. O oh God, help me. You are my helper and my deliverer. O oh Lord, do not delay. O oh Lord, hear my prayer. Give ear to my supplication in your truth. Answer me in your righteousness. Do not enter into judgment with your servant, for no one living shall become righteous in your sight. For the enemy persecuted my soul. He humbled my life to the ground. He caused me to dwell in dark places as one long dead, and my spirit was in anguish within me. My heart was troubled within me. I remembered the days of old, and I meditated on all your works. I meditated on the works of your hands. I spread out my hands to you. My soul thirsts for you like a waterless land. Hear me speedily, O Lord. My spirit faints within me. Turn not your face from me, lest I become like those who go down into the pit. Cause me to hear your mercy in the morning, for I hope in you. Make me know, O Lord, the way wherein I should walk, for I lift up my soul to you. Deliver me from my enemies, O Lord, for to you I flee for refuge. Teach me to do your will, for you are my God. Your good spirit shall guide me in the land of uprightness. For your name's sake, O Lord, give me life. In your righteousness you shall bring my soul out of affliction. In your mercy you shall destroy my enemies. You shall utterly destroy all who afflict my soul, for I am your servant. Glory to God in the highest, and on earth peace to will to men. We praise you, we bless you, we worship you, we glorify you, and we thank you for your great glory. Lord King, Heavenly God, Father Almighty, Only Begotten Son, Lord Jesus Christ and Holy Spirit, Lord God, the Lamb of God, the Son of the Father, who take away the sin of the world, have mercy on us, you who take away the sins of the world. Accept our supplication, you who sit at the right of the Father, and have mercy on us. For you are the only Holy One, you are the only Lord, Jesus Christ, and the glory of God the Father, Amen. Every evening I shall bless you, and I shall praise your name forever, and unto the ages of ages. Lord, you have become for us a refuge from generation to generation. I have said, Lord, have mercy on me. Heal my soul, for I have sinned against you. Lord, to you have I pledged. Teach me to do your will, for you are my God. For with you is the fountain of life. In your life you shall see life. Extend your mercy to those who know you. Grant, O Lord, that in this night we may, may be kept without sin. Blessed are you, O Lord, the God of our fathers, and praised and glorified is your name unto the ages. Amen. Let your mercy, Lord, come upon us, just as we have hoped in you. Blessed are you, O Lord, teach me your commandments. Blessed are you, O Master, make me understand your commandments. Blessed are you, O Holy One, enlighten me with your commandments. Lord, your mercy remains forever. Do not turn away from the works of your hands. You belongs praise, you belongs to him, you belongs glory, to the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit, now and ever into the ages of ages. Amen. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Glory to the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit, both now and ever into the ages of ages. Amen. 
All Holy Trinity, have mercy on us. Lord, forgive our sins. Master, pardon our transgressions. Holy One, visit and heal our infirmities for your name's sake. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Glory to the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not to temptation, but deliver us from evil. the kingdom and the power and the glory of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, now and forever, and the ages of ages. Praise him for his mighty acts. Praise him according to the abundance of his greatness. Lord of the powers, be with us. For no other helper do we have in tribulations but you. Praise him with timbrel and dance, praise him with strings and flute. Lord of the powers, be with us. For no other helper do we have in tribulations but you. God and his saints. Praise him in the firmament of his power. Lord of the powers, be with us. For no other helper do we have in tribulations but you. to the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. O oh Lord, if we did not have your saints as intercessors and your benevolence being compassionate towards us, how would we dare to extol you, O Savior, whom the angels bless unceasingly? O Master, who know our hearts, we pray you to spare our souls. Both now and ever into the ages of ages. Amen.
O Theotokos, my offenses are indeed very many. To you I run, O made impure, and I pray for salvation. Visit my infirm and ailing soul, and pray for me to your Son and our God, to grant to me forgiveness for the evils I have done, O only blessed Lady. O oh, holy Theotokos, during my lifetime, I pray do not abandon me, nor entrust me to me. Lord of mercy, 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 Lord O Christ our God, who at all times and at every hour, both in heaven and on earth, are worshipped and glorified, long-suffering and plenteous in mercy and compassion, who love the just and show mercy to the sinners, who call all men to salvation through the promise of the blessings to come. Do you, the same Lord, receive also our supplications at this present time, and direct our lives according to your commandments. Sanctify our souls, purify our bodies, set our minds right, clear up our thoughts, and deliver us from every sorrow, evil, and distress. Surround us with your holy angels so that being guarded and guided by their presence, we may arrive at the unity of the faith and the knowledge of your ineffable glory. For blessed are you unto ages of ages. Amen. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Glory to the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit, both now and ever and to the ages of ages. Amen. Greater in honor than the cherubim and in glory greater beyond compare than the seraphim. You, without corruption, gave birth to God the Word, and are truly Theotokos. You do we magnify. In the name of the Lord, Father, bless. May God have compassion on us and bless us. May his face shine upon us and have mercy on us. Amen. O Lord and Master of my life, do not forget the spirit of laziness and memory, the lustful power and idle heart to come into. Instead, grant me your servant the spirit of prudence, humility, patience, and love. Yes, Lord and King, give me the power to see my own faults and not to judge my brother. We are blessed in the of ages. Amen. Amen. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Glory to the Father, to the Son, to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. All holy Trinity, have mercy on us. Lord, forgive our sins. Master, pardon our transgressions. Holy One, visit and heal our infirmities for your name's sake. What a mercy, what a mercy, what a mercy. Glory to the Father, to the Son, to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not in temptation, but deliver us from evil. The light of the kingdom and the power and the glory of the Father, and the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, now and forever, and to the ages of ages. Thank you. 
Honorable Bob was a part of the tenant, the supplications of the Honorable Glorious Prophet and the Lord John the Baptist, the Holy Glorious and Gracious Apostles, our fathers among the saints and great priorities of the Ecumenical Teachers, Basil the Great Gregory, the Theologian of Mount Christendom, Athanasius, Cyril, and John Honors of the Patriarchs of Alexandria, Nicholas, Bishop of Nero, Spirit of the Bishop of Trinitus, and Claudius and Pentapolis, the Wonder Workers, the Holy Glorious Great Martyrs, George the Victorious, Demetrios, and Middle East. Theodore the Terrell and Theodore the General, Minas the Wonder Worker, the higher martyrs of all those who know Theodos, of the Holy Glorious and Victorious Martyrs, of the Glorious Great Martyr and all who have the Mia, the Holy and Glorious Martyrs, Thecla, Barbara, Anna, Cecilia, Catherine, King, and King, and King, and King, Marina, Protestant, and King, and King, of our Holy and God-bearing Fathers, of St. Andrew, the first call of the Apostle, the Heavenly Patron of this Chapel, of the Holy and Righteous Ancestors of God, Joachim, and Anna, and of all your saints. Accept our prayer. Amen. And forgiveness of our transgression. Amen. Protect us under the shelter of your wings. Amen. Drive away from us every enemy and adversary. Amen. Bring peace to our lives. Amen. For have mercy on us and on your world. And save our souls as a good and loving God. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, to the ages of ages. Amen. What a mercy, what a mercy, what a mercy. Father, bless. The Christ, our true God, in the intercession of his altar and all the back to the Holy Mother, of uh, uh, all of the saints, and to the first call of the apostles, of the holy righteous ancestors of God, Joachim, and then of all the saints, have mercy on us, and save us, as a good and loving God. Let us pray for the peace of the word. In the name of Jesus. Virgin was watching you, O Christ, as you were unjustly slaughtered, and lamenting, she cried aloud, O sweetest son of mine, how are you suspended on a cross and dying now? For you of old suspended the earth on water, O most merciful benefactor, I, your handmaiden, and your mother, pray you not abandon me. Our next service will be tomorrow evening in the salutations of the fair focus, which will be at 7 